The Timex Sinclair 2068 TS2068, released in November 1983, was Timex Sinclair's fourth and last home computer for the United States market. It was also marketed in Argentina, Portugal and Poland, as the Timex Computer 2068. A variant of the machine was later sold in Poland under the name Unipolbrit Computer 2086. Topic: <laughs> Technical Specifications. The TS2068 was based on the ZX Spectrum and followed Timex's ZX81 based TS1000 and TS1500, and the Spectrum based TC2048. Advertisements described the TS2068 as offering 72K of memory, color, and sound for a price under $200. Like the TS2048 was announced as a 40K memory machine 16K RAM plus 24K ROM, so the 2068 was announced as a 72K machine 48K RAM plus 24K ROM. The TS2068 was a more sophisticated device, significantly changed from its UK ancestor. Arguably one of the first Sinclair clones to significantly improve on the original design, it added a number of new features. An i38912 sound chip, as later used by Sinclair in the ZX Spectrum Plus 128K but mapped to different I.O. ports and thus incompatible. Twin joystick ports A slightly better chiclet keyboard", with plastic keycaps. A cartridge port to the right of the keyboard for ROM-based software. An improved ULA offering additional screen modes. The standard Sinclair 256 x 192 mode with a color resolution of 32 x 24. An extended color mode. 256 times 192 pixels with color resolution of 32 times 192. A monochrome 512 times 192 Medesinclair Basic was extended with new keywords stick, sound, on air, free, delete, reset to address the new hardware and the machine offered bank switched memory, allowing ROM cartridges to be mapped in. However, these changes made the machine incompatible with most Spectrum machine code software, which is to say virtually all commercial titles, less than 10% would run successfully. In an attempt to remedy this, many TS users built a cartridge with a Spectrum ROM for emulation. The emulation was sufficiently accurate that it was able to run the majority of software produced for the Spectrum. Later, Timex of Portugal produced a Spectrum emulator cartridge that would auto-boot. This cartridge did not fit in a TS2068 as it was higher than TC2068 cartridges. The TC2068 casing was changed to accommodate this. Although Timex Computer Corporation folded in February 1984, the independent Portuguese division continued to sell the machine in Portugal as the Timex Computer 2068, and Poland until 1989, as the Unipolbrit Computer 2086. Although the Portuguese made TC2068 was also sold in Poland, only the UK 2086 was actually made there. 
Timex of Portugal sold two versions of TC2068, the silver TC2068 version came with a ZX Spectrum emulator cartridge and a black TC2068 version sold with TimeWord word processing cartridge plus the Timex 232 rupees interface to use TimeWord with a 232 rupees printer. Strangely the black version came with a silver keyboard template with TimeWord commands to be used with the program. It can be removed because it is not glued to the black keyboard template, although the TS2068's main improvements over the original Spectrum were in areas that had come in for widespread criticism graphics, sound, keyboard and—to a lesser extent, the lack of joystick ports and cartridge support, it was not used as the basis for the Spectrum's successors. The ZX Spectrum Plus changed the keyboard only, and even the ZX Spectrum Plus 128K announced in May 1985, but not released in the UK until February 1986 retained the original machine's graphical capabilities. However, unlike the UK models, the TS2068 was not burdened by the requirement of compatibility with previous models. Topic: <laughs> Differences between TS2068, TC2068 and UK2086. As Timex Computer Corporation made the TS2068 hardware incompatible with the ZX Spectrum, Timex of Portugal made some changes to the TC2068. Replaced the bus buffers with resistors like ZX Spectrum. Changed the I.O. connector to be ZX Spectrum compatible, not requiring the Zebra Twister board. Changed the cartridge slot top casing to accept bigger cartridges ZX Spectrum emulator and TimeWord cartridges will not fit in the TS2068 cartridge slot without modification of the slot. Instead of 15 volts, it uses 9 volts. Unipolbrit also made some changes to the TC2068 for their computer 2086. Modified ROM Replaced a joystick port with a parallel printer interface Software list Timex Computer Corp. published seven cartridges and 37 cassettes to start the launch of the TS-2068 some titles were released both on cartridge and tape. The software was varied, ranging from utilities and personal accounting programs, to educational titles and games. All software have a part number and are grouped with all software of the same kind. Four cartridges and 22 tapes planned were never released and from the known list, 10 titles are missing. Timex of Portugal released some more cartridges ZX Spectrum emulator and Time Word were sold with the TC2068, software in tapes and software on FDD discs. Tassord for Timex FDD was sold by Timex of Portugal. Topic: Reception. Popular Mechanics in February 1984 called the Timex Sinclair 2068's keyboard a mixed blessing and reported a flaw in the video signal, but liked its basic and concluded that, "...for $200, the 2068 is a nice package." See also 
Timex Sinclair 2048 Computer 2086 Topic Footnotes Carrot note that the 2086 in the name was not a corruption of 2068. The 86 derived from the year the computer was first made.